Libra, what's going on, sugar dumpling? I hope you're doing well. Happy Monday, Libra. I hope you have a beautiful week. Sending you a lot of love, Libra. A lot of love. I'm going to pull some oracle messages for you first, Libra, and then we're going to pull from the tarot, okay? Libra, Libra, Libra. Sun, moon, Venus, rising off. No, this is for you. Take what resonates with you and leave the rest with somebody else out there. Everything may not be for you, Libra. Please come in and use your discernment. Sun, moon, Venus, rising north, no Libra, okay? Let's pull some oracle messages for you. Let's get some fortune oracles here. And then I'm going to pull from the magical spirit oracle. And then I'm going to pull from the tarot, okay? Libra, let's see what's going on. Libra. Sun, moon, Venus, rising north, no Libra. Libra, Libra, Libra. Hey, give me some messages for the zodiac sign of Libra, please. Give me a message for Libra. Zodiac sign of Libra. Thank you. Okay. These cards are in a reverse that they shouldn't be. So I'm just going to put them in the upright. Libra. Okay. Thank you. All right. That's it. So the first card out, we have 22, okay? Somebody here could be 22 years old. Some of you could be born on the 22nd of a month, October 22nd, okay? Um, some of you could be a life path number four. Some of you could be dealing with somebody that is born in February or April. But we got the card of Mountain. Know that you are protected as you face challenges, but remain cautious, Okay? You're on your way to the mountain, to the top of the mountain, Libra. Remain cautious, even though you are protected as you face these challenges. Just be on your P's and Q's, okay, baby? Some of you could be 34 years old as well. Some of you could be born um, October 7th. You may be a light path number 7. Um, some of you could be uh, 43 years old. Uh, also, some of you could be born... Some of you could be dealing with somebody um, that is those ages as well. Some of you could be dealing with somebody that's born in July, okay? But it says, a time of divine understanding, renewal, peace, and hope. You radiate and attract great love. Love that for you, Libra. Next card out, we have the sun, okay? Again with the threes. So I'm getting a lot of threes here. Yeah, then we got the card of 13. That's more threes. So some of you could be seeing 333, three, three, okay? You could be seeing 444. Four, four. Uh, we also have 444 four, four here as well. 34, 13, and 22. Okay, so 333 three, three, and 444. Four, four. Some of y'all may be seeing those angel numbers a lot. All right. Also, some of you could be born on the 13th of a month. You could be a life path number four. Um, some of you could um, have a child that's 13 years old. All right. Some of you could be 30 years old. Okay. Some of you could have a child that's 30 as well. All right, but we got the card of the sun. Open your heart to the enormous growth ahead. Open up your heart to the enormous growth ahead, Libra. Some of you like sunflowers. Somebody here could have a tattoo of a sunflower, but you radiate the sun energy, raw energy, okay? You have a lot of light, okay? You shine really bright, Libra. You're like a sunflower, okay? You're shining bright. You got the card number 13, goals, okay? Some of you could have went through a transformation. This 13 is also giving me Scorpionic energy. You could have a Scorpio Mars, Scorpio Pluto, or a Scorpio Moon, okay? But it says progress is positive and personal. Goals will be achieved. So you got positive progress that you're making, and your personal goals will be achieved. A lot of you are about to come into some fortune as well with these coins here on that card. All right, Libra. Let's also pull... Um, some affirmations for you real quick let's get something from the magical spirit oracle for my libras speak give me a message for libra today what messages do you have for the zodiac sign of libra please give me a message for my libras what is it that you want to tell libra today give me a message for libra let's get some affirmations for libra today sun moon venus rising with no libra Okay, we got blessings and cursings. Bless blessings and cursings. Excuse me, Libra. I'm sorry. Again with the threes. We got 21 here. Libra, you got all threes on this table, man. Okay? 34, 30, 13, 21. 21 breaks down to a three as well. You got a lot of threes here, Libra. Okay, some of y'all seeing three, 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 three. 
three three like y'all seeing four threes at once five threes six threes some of y'all could be seeing three 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 okay like a lot of fucking threes man all right but it says blessings and curses psyche self-love beauty do not be ashamed not of your thorns or of your flowers so this is really giving me the energy that you're comfortable with who you are okay again with that cozy uh libra i channeled beyonce cozy for you the other day and i titled it alexa play cozy by beyonce and now i'm hearing cozy again comfortable in my skin cozy with who i am i love myself goddamn cozy cozy i love that song okay but you are very comfortable and cozy with who you are you're comfortable you're cozy in your skin it's like i love where i am i love who i am i love the skin i'm in i love my vessel i love everything about me libra you have a lot of self-love it's absolutely beautiful and you're not ashamed of your shadow self either this is where the true authentic self-love comes in at when you are loving you at your best and you love yourself at your worst it's nothing that anybody can tell you about about yourself that you're uncomfortable with i love that that's power that's true power right there blessings and curses psyche self-love beauty i never pulled this card for nobody this is the first time i ever pulled that card that's a first i'm glad that we pulling different cards because libra i told y'all the other day that y'all be getting the same cards in this oracle for some reason but we pulling different cards now libra Spare, give me some more i'm gonna pull two more for you from this deck and then we're going to read the affirmations and the manifestation enhances. All right. We pulled that before. But this is just telling you that you're a queen. I'm not taking that card today. Because I told y'all that so many times that you are a queen, Libra. You are in your empress energy. Okay, truth. All right. It says honor, empress. I told you. <laughs> what did you say? I just said you and your empress energy. Didn't I just say that? It says honor, empress, integrity. All right, card number 37, all right? Again, with that 10 too, like some of you um, definitely, well, 10 is October, right? 10 is the month of October. Some of you could be born October 10th as well, okay? Um, but yeah, it says that which is true will always be enough. Truth, honor, empress, integrity. You are someone of great integrity, empress. You honor yourself. You respect yourself. You honor and respect your vessel and your mind. And you stand true to who you are. You stand ten toes down. You stand firm in your beliefs. I'm hearing that you don't you don't renege. Like you are somebody that actually say what you're gonna do and you do what you're gonna say. Like, you know, like you're somebody that walks the walk and talks the talk. Like you actually walk it like you talk it okay you're not just talking about it you actually being about it all right Libra, you are the fucking truth honor empress integrity i love that yes i do okay and then we got harmony libra you know you all about harmony and peace and balance some of you resonate with oshun this sunflower and this bee is giving me oshun energy some of y'all resonate with butterfly energy as well okay and then that blue card with the c some of y'all definitely resonate with yimmy or oshun energy and again with the sunflower in this card too and look at this. The sunflower came out right underneath the sunflower on the sun card. So strong emphasis, heavy emphasis on sunflowers. Okay. But it says, may sweet and soft things find you. Libra, get ready for a soft life. Okay. You deserve a sweet and soft life, Libra. Okay. Life path number nine. You've mastered yourself. All right. Harmony, ease, inner child, softness. It's time for your inner child to shine. Okay. I'm hearing that you've healed your inner child as well. Your higher self is proud of you. You're communicating with your higher self during this time. Some of you could even be writing love letters to yourself. You could be writing a letter to your higher self. You could be writing a letter to your inner child. You could be writing a letter to your current self as your inner child. And you could be writing a letter as your higher self to the person that you currently are and also your inner child. So you're reversing it. That's some beautiful communication right there, Libra. Write it down. Journal it. Write those love letters. Write to your inner child. Write to your higher self. Let your higher self write to you. Communicate with your higher self. Communicate with your inner child. Okay? The child that you were is really proud of who you are now. And your higher self is really proud because every day you're becoming a better version of yourself. Every day you're getting closer to becoming your higher self. Libra, you are like... 
Libra, y'all so fucking fantastic, man. Y'all are fucking powerful, yo. Libra, you fucking powerful, baby. Like, I'm just, you know, I know you know. I, I get it that you know, all right? I know you know that already. <laughs> but I'm just saying, you just everything, Libra. You are just really every fucking thing, man. You really are, Libra. You are everything. You are nothing short of amazing, man. All right, let's see. Holy Spirit, give me a message for Libra. Give me a message for my Libras right now. Two more shuffles for my Empresses, please. Give me a message for Libra. Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, North Node, Libra. Messages for Libra. Okay, I'm so sick of this cancer being in y'all energy. If you're dealing with a cancer, I mean, this person, you you don't fuck with them. Okay, I really need this can Yeah, double cancer. This this cancer got to get the fuck on. This cancer has to get the fuck on. They have to get the fuck on. Okay, it's time to move around, cancer. Libra don't fuck with you, and I'm sorry. But they don't. Okay? Like, I'm so sick of this cancer's energy. Libra, if you um check out... um. First of all, your energy is beautiful, so I'm not even about to let this take me there. But if you um check out the uh yesterday I did Libra versus all signs, and I promise you, when I got to cancer, it was so negative, it was so much animosity, okay? Like Libra, what is going on between you and this cancer? Like what is going on with the cancer energy? If this person's not a cancer son, they have cancer in their chart, but I do know that one of you that watched me a lot. You keep writing comments about a cancer that you can't stand. So this is for you, sweetheart. All right. Some of y'all really having issues with a cancer or a cancer has issues with you. Or I don't know. Take it as a resume. But there could be a cancer that wants you to be stuck in the past. Okay. There, there's a cancer that could be stuck on you as well. But fuck that shit. You stay in focus right now. It says stay focused. Remember why you started. Period. Stay focused on your purpose. Stay focused on your mission. Okay, your road is clear. Your road is open. Just continue to go forward. Just continue to move forward. I feel like a lot of you are making sacrifices during this time. Okay, because you know that the end result is going to be worth it. So, yeah, you're doing what you need to do. I also feel like somebody here don't want you to see the truth about a situation. Okay, what's the truth in a reverse here? Somebody here could be lying to you. Could be a fucking cancer, okay? For some of y'all, somebody with strong cancer in your chart. Somebody here don't want you to see the truth about a situation. We're getting Taurus too, so strong cancer, strong Taurus, very significant here. Somebody here don't want to accept the fact that you've healed. Somebody here don't want to accept the fact that you're not codependent, okay? Could be a Scorpio as well. Some of y'all could be disconnected from any of these signs, a Taurus, a Scorpio, or a cancer. But you got money opportunities, Libra. I had already told you. With goals and these coins, I told you, I feel like there's some sort of abundance here, a windfall, and then we got money opportunity. I love it. Libra, get to the fucking bag, okay? Tell them, cut the fucking check. All right? Cut the check. My income is constantly increasing. I can't make this shit up. Oh, my God. I can't make it up fucking money opportunity and right behind that my income is constantly increasing both in the upright Libra what the fuck y'all got going on okay send me a cash app send me a donation let me know that you support the channel Libra shit what the fuck buy me some motherfucking coffee or lunch today Libra <laughs> I'm just fucking with y'all all right but seriously though oh my god Libra yes look at you ten of cups beautiful fucking energy Ten of Cups, my income is constantly increasing. Money opportunity. This is your justice. This is your good karma, Libra. This is your karmic justice. This is owed to you. This is a blessing from the Most High, your Creator, your Father. Yes. Yes, okay? And don't overthink, baby. Don't overthink this. Have no fear, okay? Be fearless. Yes, the Fool card is someone that's fearless. Some of you can have Aries or Aquarius in your chart, but everything is working out in your favor. Will of fortune here in the upright, man. Will of fortune here in the upright. Will of fortune. My income is constantly increasing. Money, opportunity, ten of cups, justice. Oh, man, Libra. I'm going to put those three up here. Okay, Libra. And here you are with the justice, man. We got the fucking justice right here, Libra. Big fucking things, Libra. 
Big things, Libra. What's up, Libra? Oh, shit, Libra. <laughs> I'm excited. Are y'all excited? I'm feeling this excitement for you right now, baby. Let me tell you, honey doll. Let me, let me just tell you how exciting your energy is. Ooh, baby, you on fire, okay? You on fire. And all evil eyes are going blind is what I'm hearing. You're getting a lot of hate right now, a lot of evil eyes. Okay, but nine of cups, you're standing in your power, you're standing ten toes down, emotionally independent, secure within yourself. Okay, yes, you're secure within yourself. You're like, fuck that. I know who I am, I know what I came here to do. I know that I'm anointed, I know that I'm chosen, I know that God loves me, I know that God walks with me, I know that God sends his biggest angels and troops to fight for me. Yo, you are very sure of who you are, what you're here to do, you're sure of your creator, your belief, your faith is, it, it can't be, uh, it can't be tested, okay, I feel like your faith has been tested in the past, but you passed that shit with flying colors, like, God really appreciates the strong faith that you have in him, your faith, your belief in yourself and in the most high is what's really creating this beautiful life for you, yeah, you're free of illusions, illusions where, what illusions, there's past people that's angry, that's bitter because they wanted you to be in this state of illusion, okay? Like illusion, fear, anxiety, worry. Somebody here wanted you to be stressed about money. You clearly don't have nothing to stress about when it comes to money. I'm hearing that you will never go without. That's a fact. God is going to make sure of that. And somebody here could have been doing spell work on your finances. I've been getting that for y'all a lot. But somebody here is causing illusions, trying to do spell work and trying to get you to like not... um like not live your best life somebody here wants you to be in fear but the truth of the matter is is that you are the truth okay you literally are the truth you are the walking truth here okay and the truth is is that you're being celebrated during this time for being in your true self your true nature for you being authentic and you loving who you are is seen is felt is inspiring and motivating to others that are on their spiritual journeys that are on their paths as well people are actually looking up to you right now libra that's what i'm hearing yeah you're free you're liberated you're victorious okay i'm hearing that you feel liberated okay you're free here you keep transforming you keep reinventing yourself you keep recreating yourself you keep uh rewriting your story or adding new things to it god said that he's writing your story as well your story is already written man yeah but you just adding little things to it new beautiful things yeah you moving forward man six of swords in the chariot ain't nobody gonna block you ain't nobody gonna stop you there's no blockages your road is clear your path is clear libra look at this shit Look at this shit, man. You got the six of swords, the chariot, and the eight of cups. If this is not somebody on the fucking move, then I don't know what is. You got three fucking cards here back to back of you being on the fucking move, Libra. Six of swords, the chariot, and the eight of cups. Walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. The chariot. You are on this chariot. Your ancestors are making sure that you get to your destination. Six of swords, you get into the top of that motherfucking mountain. Your ancestors is pulling you out of the water. You're not drowning. You're being saved. It don't matter what's going on around you you're being pulled out of the chaos you're being pulled out from being um underwater from drowning they're saving you the birds and the eagles and everything the bees and the trees okay you are the bees knees i'm hearing that you are the honey bee again with that ocean energy it's like all of nature celebrates you libra god damn you connected to all that is you are walking with mother gaia energy queen of swords in the reverse here is pissed they could but they could be another libra a gemini or aquarius that's really fucking mad and a cancer that's really fucking mad and a virgo that's really fucking mad okay yeah all of these motherfuckers was doing spell work on you high priestess in the reverse they thought you wasn't gonna see that shit they thought you wasn't gonna know somebody here knows for a fact that they're not cloaked that you see clearly it's a virgo it's a pisces it's a cancer it's another libra a gemini or aquarius all doing spell work that cycle has closed out closed out who's stuck who's stuck who in a lack of mindset who in poverty not you libra not you you don't have a poverty mindset ten of cups here both times not once, but motherfucking twice. Ten of Cups is here in the upright both times. Period. You're so smart. You're so intelligent. You're so wise. Queen of Wands here. Some of y'all got strong Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius in your chart. You can have strong fire placements. I'm getting that some of my Libras got like a fire rising for some of y'all. Okay? But you the shit. You the motherfucking shit. Okay? <laughs> like, oh my goodness, Libra. God damn, baby. I mean, I ain't trying to gas y'all up, but this is just really how this shit is coming out, man. Oh my goodness. All right.
Ooh, see, bro, don't hurt nobody. You know what I'm saying? Somebody here's spell work has been revealed. We already seen that. All right, past people upset, bitter, mad, been working on you for years, been working on you for a long time. Mad because you on your path. Yeah, oh well. Mad because you woke up is what I heard for some of you. Yeah, somebody here was abusing their power, abusing their authority. Could be a mother figure involved too. This person could be a water sign or a Taurus. Okay, but this person worked for him downstairs. You know what I mean? <laughs> could be a Taurus Capricorn or a mother figure here that was working on you. Okay, somebody's mama, if it's not your mama. Okay, but you too strong. You too powerful. You too strong. And this was an un this was an injustice. This was unfair. Somebody here is going to get a lot of karma for doing this shit. I'm hearing years of karma. Okay, something is catching up to somebody. They did this shit for a long time and it's catching up to them. Libra, nine of cups, you and your power, baby. Independent, free, emotionally stable, emotionally independent on all levels. Nine of cups, 10 toes down, standing in your power, looking good, smelling good, feeling good. You are the queen of pentacles, okay? You the motherfucking champion. Did you realize that you were a champion in their eyes? Yeah, even your haters know that you're a champion. That's why they wish that they could take your legacy. They wish that they could be you. They wish that they could be in your skin. You so cozy and comfortable in your skin. You cozy with who you are. They wish that they could wear your skin. I'm hearing that you got doppelgangers, okay? You got motherfuckers that's heartbroken about your transformation, okay? Somebody here could be heartbroken about a king of wands as well. There's a king of wands that could be transforming, okay? For some of you, yep, your emperor. Ooh, baby. So your emperor is transforming. Some of you have an emperor that is inspired or motivated right now they're doing the self-work they're transforming this person is receiving a lot of hate during this time as well could be receiving a lot of hate from a taurus another libra gemini aquarius a virgo a scorpio a capricorn okay but multiple people here sending this person an evil eye because they're choosing to transform they're choosing to heal they're choosing to work on themselves everybody mad but this person is protected same way you protect them Somebody here all up in their head about this shit. They can't believe this shit. Nine of swords. Somebody here losing sleep over this shit. You healing and your emperor healing too? Fuck both of y'all. Y'all motherfuckers is healing. Now motherfuckers will heal. <laughs> okay, four of wands. Your wish fulfillment, wishes is being granted. Is here, four of wands energy. You get everything that you wish for, everything that you pray for, everything that you dream for, everything that you could desire, everything that you could want and more is here. Okay? And somebody else that you're not in alignment with is pissed off. Okay, I feel like it's this cancer, okay? There's a cancer or a Pisces that's really fucking angry right now or an Aquarius. They're really fucking mad because they feel like they missed out on the opportunity to be with you. But this is somebody that don't even fuck with you. It's just that they want to be with you because of the status that you're in, the position that you're in, the rank that you hold in the spiritual realm, the blessings that you have coming towards you. That's the only reason why this person want to connect with you, be your friend, be your business partner, or be your fake-ass lover, okay? Like, it's a fucking no. Will of Fortune here. Everything working out in your favor. Everything going. Everything's going according to plan. We got the Will of Fortune here at the top. We also have the Will of Fortune here. Okay, Will of Fortune here in both decks. I'm telling you, you're on the right side of the wheel. Moving forward, great karma here. Yeah, no more disappointment. No more sadness. Okay, no more nothing. Your tears of sadness is turning to tears of joy, Libra. Yeah, somebody here really wanted to cause an ending or a delay. Somebody here knew that they couldn't stop this, but they at least wanted to delay it. Somebody here didn't want you to reach this level to maybe another 10, 15 years from now, okay? If they could block it for that long, they would try, man. They tried, but they failed, okay? Libra, continue to keep on keeping on, okay? Continue to shine on, shine bright, Libra. You couldn't dim your light even if you tried, honey. You are on your A motherfucking game. I love you, Libra. I hope you have a beautiful Monday, and we will talk soon, okay? Peace.